We did it. <laughs> we found it. And it really looks like something sent from another planet. And my friend, Decky, he's wanted to see it for 13 years. It just um, had a really strong emotional effect on, on him. He's crying. <laughs> <laughs> it's called Rafflesia celtii, but this particular one is super rare and it grows in this really remote rainforests um, where tigers prowl by night. Hardly anyone's seen it. We did quite a long trek and had to go up river, down river, down slopes, hanging from vines. Really, it's it's just then luck. It's down to, to the gods whether you will actually find this flower open or not. And it was our moment and it opened there and then in front of our eyes. This flower is just so otherworldly. It's like an electrifying experience. You feel like you've seen and experienced something truly special um, and you sort of hold on to that magic. To have experienced that together was just, was truly special and something I'll, I'll never forget. Now, it's very rare to see this flower because apparently the buds take months to develop and then when they do, they only remain open for a couple of days. Should be noted, though, that this is also the smelliest flower in the world. It is known as the corpse flower because it emits the smell of rotting flesh. Biologists didn't seem to mind that too much.